Hi Year 4. I've taken some inspiration from Miss Dixon and Mrs Oldershaw and I've started some cooking. We've had some really lovely videos about healthy eating and about how you can design a plate of food to look really delicious and I thought it's about time we got some maths involved because I know the exact amount of ingredients I need to make one salad for myself but how could I make the quantities right if I was to make that salad for more people? Let's have a look at the most delicious recipe in the world. Guaranteed. So here's the recipe for the most delicious salad you will ever eat. You need one large tomato, four medium-sized strawberries, 16 olive pieces, one teaspoon of oil, and one teaspoon of balsamic vinegar. And that will make a tasty salad for one. Now, what would we need to do for all the other ingredients if we had two tomatoes? I don't want my recipe to be overly tomatoed. I want it still to have the delicious balance it had before. So I've doubled the tomatoes. How many strawberries am I going to need? How many olives am I going to need? How many teaspoons of oil and balsamic vinegar am I going to need? Remember it was one teaspoon for my first recipe. Okay, what about if I was treating my whole family, including my mum, my dad and my sister, to a version of my salad? So my original recipe called for one tomato. I've now got five juicy tomatoes. How many strawberries am I going to need? How many olives am I going to need? How many teaspoons of oil and vinegar am I going to need? Now there's all sorts of fun math problems you could do. If you had a punnet of strawberries that had, let's say, 20 strawberries in it. What amount of the other ingredients would you need? Or what about this problem? If you had a jar of olives and you had 176 olives in it, what would you have to do to make all of the other parts of the recipe work? 